Next up, semifinal two, match one. We have a contest of our number four alliance against our number five alliance. Let's meet our teams. Starting off with our number four seated captain in the center out of U of D Jesuit. It's 1701. All right. And their first pick on this number four seated alliance from Our Lady of the Lakes. Put your hands together for 50 53. All right. And this team looking pretty in pink, sporting the Panther ears for years and years. From Detroit International Academy, it's 2048. All right. Down on the other side, we got Alliance number five. This team has the good luck. This young man, the captain here, he asked for a date to the prom. Maybe it's his lucky charm. Gonna see if it. So let's meet a 4680, the Aztec Eagles. And their next pick on this alliance, making a lot of noise in the stands. They're real steel, 818. And the third member of this number five alliance, high shooting robot, shooting the high goals all week. And let's hear it for 3175. Yeah. Board. Are we ready in red? We are ready in blue. Let's get it started. Quarterfinal two, match one, and three, two, one, charge! Yeah. We got 17. Seventeen oh one, coming back for center field, gobbles up a boulder. While Night Vision, that team that's too legit to quit, coming in hot for the logo. Lakers down on the red alliance, trying to cycle bottom in the blue tower. They ease up and they throw it deep. That's going to get them two points. Meanwhile, we've got. The Steel Armadillos, 818, crossing the Sally Port. They back it up and they go for it again. It's a defense so nice, they want to drive over it twice. And Night Vision throws one high. Red leading 86 to blue, 49. Steel Armadillos hop over the moat. Clear that defense. As the blue out of Both the moat and the rock wall are going to need to come down in order for the bl blue lines to get the red. Leggett throws one high. As Red leads 103 to 94, that lead going under 10. 50-53 is going to attempt to go local. As look at Steel armor. Another exciting quarterfinal match, a fight to the finish. Looks like it was really close. Red was up by 10 points on the real-time score in the final seconds. But we're going to have to wait for the refs to give us a final judgment and a final score to really know who's the outcome. 
Great crowd energy and great excitement here at center line. We got a thumbs up from our scorekeeper. Show us the scores, Joel. Whoop, whoop.